So this is part five of the Winners Autopilot Reset. So obviously, um, just to give you a summarization, part one was pretty much export import, um, followed by part two, where we upload the hash um, and the default profile was shown up as the default autopilot profile, um, Azure AD join. Um, and then after that, we wait for a bit, a few minutes later to get the profile assigned to the hybrid Azure AADD joint over VPN. Um, so, and then at the same time, I was, uh, and after that, I did another video where I was showing you that um, if we were on a home edition, we could simply um, upgrade the version of the OS from home to another um, pro or enterprise version um, as this device already had pro version um, I've just merely did a system reset and now we're at welcome to now test PTY LTD so in order for this to take place um, here I just have to type in my username so this is the way this is the person who enrolls the device this person will be the enroller um, if we need to change the um, primary user we can do that with this with this part we've actually in, added the MFA um, and digital MFA so I always take it type in here it will ask me for my password which I'll enter right here and the next bit is where it will actually ask me so I just set up and now it's asking for additional MFA so let's bring my phone as you can see and what we'll do is, yep, and then we'll approve it, and then we'll authenticate again. So that's all good. Now that will notify this device right here. So as this is a hybrid um, Azure AD join over VPN, um, this will um, actually take some time. So you'll see the whole process here. So it will, it, so with this bit, I'll actually turn off the enrollment status page. Um, if we did have the enrollment status page, you'll see it. And it does actually take quite a long time. So I've kind of um, removed it in a way because um, it's not 100% successful. Um, sometimes it works 50% and then other times it fails. Um, so just to not get people to panic too much, uh, we're just gonna let this roll. So obviously, oh, please wait to while we set this device. So ideally what happens here is that after this, um, it should just restart your device. Um, you will have to still select your um, country, your language and so forth to actually get there. And then after that, um, since, and since it normally will prompt for Wi-Fi or internet access, but since I'm wired, I'm going to my home router at the moment. Um, that would kick true and it will bring you to the NAM test login screen. Um, so I'll let this roll for a while. I won't talk at the moment, so at least that way it'll just power true. And you can see that it's going to restart the device. Um, with the red lock, um, it's because I have turned off from um, secure boot, so. So it's going to load to just a moment, it'll get there eventually.
this is where you choose. So this is your privacy. Um, obviously, when you do an autopilot hybrid um, reset, or if it's other done, if it's either um, done through a hybrid or Azure, um, this does pop up. And location is important because obviously I have a thing called um, Windows Auto um, Time Zone. So what it does, it uses the location based on where you are, and this will set your time zone correctly. So you click accept, and what this will do will bring you to the screen. Um, so obviously the time right now is four fifteen. Um, we'll just bring it right here. So four fifteen, and if I click OK, you get the legal legal notice. So if you were at work today, um, you can send me just log in, and you don't have to actually wait for the Cisco log. Um, so we'll um, continue again twenty minutes later because I need to wait for the Cisco log to get installed, and then I'll restart the device, and then off we go. Thank you.